We're here at 500 Startups to see a new company that's really helping people with their email. Uh, a lot of times when you send an email around or if you're creating a marketing campaign or, a, or you're going on a funding campaign, you need to send the same thing over and over again, but they have a system that templatizes it, makes it uh, really easy to send the same kind of email back and forth. It's perfect, it's crack for marketers and we're gonna hear about it right now with Tau. <laughs> Who are you? Uh, I'm TK. I'm the founder of Tout. Uh, I've been building simple software that helps people communicate better for about 10 years. I started with group calendaring, then I worked at Plaxo working on their email clients, and now I'm working on Tout. It's a tool that helps people communicate better with the idea of email templates. All right, so it, it, when you say email templates, most people are like, their eyes glaze over, right? Yeah. It's like, what? I don't need that. I'm, I'm not a marketing team that's going to send out a lot of spam or anything like that. But I love how you did it, and it's really simple, and it sort of re learns as you send email what you're trying to do. T take me through the UI a little bit and tell me what, what it does. I think the first thing to kind of highlight is, you know, with, with emails, we don't realize it, but we have certain patterns of communication. We are doing the same stuff over and over or through email. We just don't think about it. Um, what we've recognized is you send the same type of content very often, and you tweak little parts of it. And that's where templates come in, where you take the parts that are kind of very repetitive, and you save those for later use. That way, you save time by sending your emails. The, the canned stuff come in really quickly, and you focus on your time to actually personalize the content and make it more meaningful. That way, you can communicate better. Yeah. Does this, by the way, does this work on all email, or do I need to have Gmail or a, a web-based email? Uh, tell me how to get it first. Yeah. Yeah, so we, you can go to toutapp.com, that's T-O-U-T-A-P-P.com. We're a simple web application where you can just get started in 30 seconds. You don't have to talk to your IT team if you're in a company or hook it up to Gmail and give us your data or anything like that. We can get help you get started within 30 seconds. And basically you just set up your email address, you verify it, and you can start creating templates and sending emails really quickly. And our UI makes it super easy for you to actually create your templates, where it's, it's a simple web app, so you can just go hit new template and actually um, put in the name of the template and put in your content. We consider it one of the last times you'll actually copy and paste email, because everyone does this. When you're actually responding to an email or sending an email, you go and search, and you find that last time you sent that email, and you copy it, and then you paste it, and you spend another minute fixing the formatting because the colors are different when you paste it. So we solve that problem really quickly. So you just create your templates once, and that way, every time you want to send an email, whether it's from our iPhone app, or from our website, or we're going to be introducing a Gmail extension soon that it goes right into Gmail. Actually, this video will probably go up after you've introduced uh, Gmail, so okay. Gmail's out now, probably. Yeah, so with, with Gmail, you can just install our extension, and that way you just hit on the little template name, and it'll pop in right away. And then you, s you actually spend your time writing the unique content. Okay. So we have a lot of customers, and they've told us, in average, they save about two minutes per email. Yeah. So our system's processed over 75,000 emails, so that's over 140,000 minutes saved already. And you're only a few weeks old. You're a brand new company, right? We're a brand new company. I wouldn't call it weeks, <laughs> more like months, but okay. <laughs> but yeah, we, we've, been help we've helped about 5,000 people so far, and we're growing very quickly. Very cool. And we're here in the 500 startups. Uh, uh, Incubation space, I guess, is the right yeah. We are, we are part of. So we are a New York company. We're out here in Mountain View for the uh, for the summer, uh, probably a little bit longer, and we're part of the 500 Stars Accelerator program. So it's been a really awesome experience, and you can't beat the weather. Now, how, how much does this cost to, to use or buy, and, and is there a free trial so people can try it out and there see is, how it works? Yeah, there is absolutely a free trial. You can uh, sign up from the App Store and get a, get a free lifetime account. There's a, the, the iPhone app is paid, but you get one of our premium accounts for, li for, your, for the lifetime. Uh, or you can go to our website and sign up with, using our free plan and even take one of our premium plans for a trial. Uh, if you like it and you want to use it, um, we charge, we have, a star, we have a starter plan at $12, and then it goes higher depending on more, more features you want to use and if you want to bring your whole team onto Tout to use it. Yeah, when you're creating one of these uh, templates, I've used template email systems before, and you had to learn codes to put in, like, dear first name, right. you know, uh, hello, and other stuff you could automatically fill into the email. Yep. Can you do the same thing with your templates? Yeah, absolutely. We have a couple of fields that are what we call dynamic fields. So you can technically write a template like, hey, first name, I hope things are going well at company name. I'm thinking of visiting home state, want to meet up. <laughs> 
right? Yeah. And you can send off that template. It's highly personalized when you send it out. Uh, that's certainly possible with our product. Yeah. Does this in increase the chances that you're going to get into the spam filter, you know, in Gmail? Because I know a lot of stuff sometimes seems to end up there that looks sort of templatized. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So we've actually put in quite a bit of effort to figure out what it is, what, what's a spam message and what's not. And obviously email marketers have spent a lot of time doing it as well. And there are a couple of things we think about. The first thing is we price our product in a way where it's too expensive for spammers to use. So we'll, we'll hopefully be used by people that actually want to reach out to you and actually want to communicate with you. And our software exists so that you can do that better, faster, and you can even do your introductions or your emails in a much better way. We teach you how to write better emails. Tell me about how much it costs. Uh, so it starts at $12 a month, okay. and that's our starter plan. So it lets you send a certain number of emails a day. Uh, we actually put limits on our system where you can't send more than 25 to 100 emails per day because then yeah. you get into the board, into the line over you're probably doing something in mass and it's more spam than trying to actually meaningfully connect with other people. Right. So we put limits on that. That's one of the things that we get a lot actually. You know, they ask us how are we different from Mailchimp or Constant Contact. You know, we're not about you have a list of a thousand people and you want to email all of them. We're much more about you just met 50 people at a conference and you want to follow up with them. And it's largely, largely the same email, but you want to do it in the right way. Yeah. We help you do that faster. Uh, very cool. Um, take me through the UI again and uh, tell me what it's like to, to create one and then use it. Okay, so I think the first thing that you do is basically you sign up. It takes about 30 seconds. You can sign up using your Google account, your uh, Salesforce account, your Google Apps account, any one of those. Once you're set up, the first thing you'll have to do is basically tell us who you are. Uh, we help. We make you uh, set up a little email signature uh, that says, you know, what your name is, what your company is, what your title is, and your phone number. We force you to do that a because we want to verify that you are who you are. You're not signing up as Bill Gates, or I'm not signing up as you and saying, hey, I'd love to interview all of you guys, or something like that. Um, and also, we found that it actually helps spam filters. If you have a proper signature, your email seems much more legit. It will go through. So once you have that set up, the next thing you can do is you can connect our product into any one of the other systems that you use. A lot of people that use Tout also happen to use a CRM system. Uh, so we integrate with Salesforce, with HireEyes, with Batchbook, with Capsule. So you can connect with any one of those so that your contacts are already in Tout. We also connect with LinkedIn. So if you are connecting with a lot of people on LinkedIn and you want to send LinkedIn messages, those are highly repetitive as well. You can send them right from Tout as well. Got it. And so you basically connect the systems at where you have your contacts. And once you do that, uh, we, we help you spend a couple of minutes actually creating your first couple of templates. So we have a whole template library, and it's being public. We have a bunch of templates that are published by experts in different fields. So if you're trying to write the perfect email for sales, for marketing, for raising money for your investors, for reaching out to customers to do customer development, we have templates for you. Got it. So you can start with that, or you can put in one of your own templates. And you can create it by going to the Templates tab, hitting New, putting in the information, and hitting Save. Yeah. Once that's done, you know, we generally recommend you, know, you use existing templates. Uh, one of the things we don't tell you to do is just write a template. Because when you just write a template, it looks like you wrote a template. So you know, one of the things that people constantly ask us is like, well, th will they know I'm using a template? We're like, well, they'll know if it's a bad template. <laughs> So we always tell you to write an email to an actual person first and then turn that into a template because then it's much more genuine and it's much more real. Got it. So once that's all done, you can just start sending emails really quickly. Yeah. Um, and you have a little uh, search feature to find contact names and stuff like that. Yeah, we actually, so that's, this is one of the interesting things we've started to do. If you look at our contact section, we have all of your contacts across Gmail, your CRM, your Twitter, your LinkedIn, everywhere. And we also make it super easy to group people into groups. Uh, it's sort of reminiscent of Google Circles, except it's your email address book. So we actually know who are the people you email very often and who you, who you email together. So we make it super easy to put them into groups. I have an investors group, I have a VIP customers group, and a family group. And you can drag, them, drag an address into a group and have tout groups so that you can send personalized emails to groups as well. well that's really cool. Can I do automatic responses and have those templates? I'm not sure if, because right now I have an out of office message reply yeah. that goes to everybody and it bothers the hell out of everybody. So we've, we've thought a lot about, you know, there's a, there's, this, is, this is the stuff we do now. And to help people communicate better, we have recognized that there are other patterns of communication we want to do more of. So automatic responses is one. Uh, another, uh, another awesome one would be uh, a scheduling template where you, where you hit the template that says let's meet up and it automatically fills in saying hey I'd love to meet up. It already has access to your Google Calendar so it'll say here are three times that worked for me. Yeah. All in the email. 
So there's a lot of interesting use cases that are there. Uh, and we want to start exploring those soon. We just haven't done that yet. We wanted to make sure that the sending and receiving of the frequently sent content is, is totally owned, yeah. totally, totally awesome in our product and in Gmail and in our iPhone app. Uh, so we're getting close to that, so we'll be moving over to these other use cases next. Very cool. Can I work with my, I just hired an assistant to help me uh, deal with my in inbox because yep. it's just out of control. <laughs> I, I can't answer every email. We're probably helping uh, with our own. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're helping people generate even more email that gets into my inbox. Well, but we can help your assistant too. Yeah. yeah. So, so, so can I write a template and she can use that template? Absolutely. So you can, you can do it in a number of ways. You can share a template. So, Usually people use our team plan where you write these templates and you share it with your whole team. That way everyone has consistent messaging. Yeah. And because, uh, this is one of the things we haven't talked about, where our, our product helps you track your emails too. The analytics behind our product where it tells you if a person viewed the email or if they clicked on it. So no longer do you keep that mental workflow of like, did they get back to me, did it work, and all those things. We help you track all that automatically. With the team plan, you can actually share templates with your assistant or you can share your account with your assistant so she can she knows how to respond to different stuff based on your wording. So your assistant yeah. actually sounds like you um, when she's responding on your behalf. Yeah. How, uh, tell me a little bit more about the um, tracking features. So you know, what, what are they for and, and how do they work? Sure, so the main reason we created the tracking features in, uh, in Tout is to solve the problem of you send out all these emails. You know, we spend hours a day sp sending emails to people, going back and forth. But there's, no, there's nothing out there that's actually stopping and helping you think about, is, are you being effective in your yeah. email habits? So that's why we started to build in tracking on every single email that you send day to day. So we start to track automatically if the person that you send the email to actually viewed it. We start to track if they clicked on the link that you have in there. And we also uh, track this arbitrary metric of success. So once you, like, you, know, you send an email and they respond back and you get, get the deal done or whatever it is that you're trying to achieve, you can mark that as successful so that you know that template that you use actually helps you achieve a certain goal. Right. All around like what we do as a company to help people communicate better. Can I pay you to block all those features? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. So I don't want I don't want all the PR people knowing that I didn't check out the, or that I did check out their email. We'll probably charge you to like <laughs> make up the story of what you want them to see. <laughs> so yeah, so there, I mean there, we have some ideas around that as well actually. Yeah. But with analytics, it helps you track you know how many of your emails are actually being viewed, how many of them are clicked how many of them are successful. So the idea is over time we can start to get actual metrics around you sent 100 emails using this let's meet up template and only 10% responded. So either people don't like you or you're not saying the right thing. You know. So there's a lot of synthesis that we can, we can kind of draw out of your email activity. And those are the kind of things we want to start looking at uh, as we start to grow our user base. And that's why this is so useful for marketers because they can iterate on, their, on how they're communicating with people and yeah. improve those uh, uh, action rates, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, we started off as mainly a sales tool, right? And so, and then it, it turned out domainers love us, uh, SEO people love us, yeah. marketers, salespeople love us, people looking for jobs love us because they're sending all these resumes out, and for once they can actually see visibility into did they view it, but they didn't get back to me. Like, it, it gives visibility into the black hole. So that, and, and that's one of the reasons they love it. It gives you visibility. It also gives you some advanced tools, like you could do A/B testing even if you want to get advanced on like try different hooks on your messaging yeah. and see which one performs better because Tout tracks all of them for you. So there's a lot you can do with that. Very cool. Tell me a little bit about the fundamentals. You're, you're in the 500 startups program, but how are you funded? Uh, sure, so we actually did an advisory round earlier on this year with uh, Esther Dyson, Eric Ries, Dave McClure, 500 startups, and a lot of other angels. And that was our advisory round. We have a really awesome group of people that really care about the vision for the company. Yeah. Uh, and that's to help people communicate better. We just happen to be doing that by improving email right now. And as the demo day approaches for 500 startups, we'll probably be doing another round. Um, and it, it'll be interest, it's interesting to see. We, have, we charge for our product. We have revenue. So it'll be interesting to see uh, how much to raise versus how much to just actually double down on being a real business. Yeah. <laughs> well, it sounds like you're on your way. Um, I love that you had a blog post that explained how you use the product to raise the money, right? Yeah, yeah. So this kind of connects with our whole email template library, which we recently launched. We actually evolved on that idea when we were talking to one of our investors, Esther Dyson, when she was just like, you know, when are you going to do more content? I'm like, what do you mean? She's like, well, think about it. You're doing templates, but what you're really doing is you're teaching people how to write better emails. So I can see how you can release a set of templates in Egypt or you know, in, in a lot of third world countries where entrepreneurship is slowly growing, but they don't know how to communicate with the Western world. 
And through the idea of templates, you can teach people actually how to email and how to communicate. Yeah. And that was one of those ideas where like, wow, that's, that's kind of profound if you think about it. So you're moving away from this idea of a template where it's like canned, boring, to like it teaches you how to write better emails yeah. and to achieve your goal better. So that's why we have the template library where it's a whole collection of different templates that you can use to achieve different goals. So I actually wrote a set of templates that I use four templates. Uh, I manage my entire fundraising process uh, on Tout. And I, so I basically published those four templates on how to respond to an angel list intro, how to close a deal, how to send your terms, all that stuff that you do, highly repetitive, all over email. You can do it with Tout. You can actually see if the investors actually viewed your email and then chose not to respond, or you know they're, they're running late, and you need to send a reminder, and all that kind of stuff. Cool. And we think there's going to be more like that in the template library where we teach people how to achieve different things over email through te through templates. Very cool. Can I uh, have your email list of all the investors you hit up? <laughs> <laughs> sure. I have a tower group for that, so I can intro you. I don't think you need an intro. But <laughs> I, can I, I, can I see if, uh, if we've uh, beat your percentage of uh, action? <laughs> <laughs> now, that would be interesting, a leaderboard of like who gets more. Yeah. So there, like we said, there's a lot of data in your inbox, and we're yeah. starting to actually quantify it. So it's it's kind of interesting. Very cool. Where do we learn more about it? So you can go to toutapp.com. That's T-O-U-T-A-P-P.com. And you can find out everything about the product over and there. And you're on Twitter and Facebook and everyone. Yeah, we're on Twitter. So on Twitter, you can follow me. It's uh, T-A-W-H-E-E-D. Uh, and you can follow Tout App. It's again, T-O-U-T-A-P-P. Uh, we're on Twitter. We love Twitter. Uh, we've come, come to a point where we, a lot of our customers sign up for the product and then tweet about the fact that they're using the product. So it's great. Uh, we love Twitter. A lot of our communities are over there. So. Very cool. Thank you so much. Thanks a lot. Thanks for helping us with our email problems. Hopefully. <laughs>